Hello friends. Here it is a module I'm going to demonstrate today. This module has been designed and developed by Brainstorm Technologies. It's an ESP8266 based module programmer. By using this module we will be able to program ESP12V, ESP12F and ESP07 very easily using our Arduino IDE, Explorer or ESP8266 Flasher. This module is very much compact in size. It's having micro USB connector to connect with a computer and it's having a reset switch to reset the module anytime, if required. Its pins adjusts in the ESP module's available slots and ESP module connects with it properly. It works as good as the development boards available in the market like this. By using this module we will be able to connect our ESP module directly to the computer using USB cable. It can be possible to program and write down the firmware on ESP modules before soldering it on the PCB board. We can sell these pre-programmed ESP modules or we can give it to someone else to use your firmware without giving him the source code. For the demonstration, here it is I have connected the ESP12F module to my laptop using this programmer through USB cable. I am going to use a very elementary example to demonstrate this module and that is a blink example of the Arduino IDE. This sketch will blink the onboard LED with a frequency of 1 second. Here it is I'm opening the Arduino IDE and starting the blink sketch. Here I'm going to select the port where my programmer is connected with this laptop. Here it is the port where my programmer is connected. It is the serial port number 8, so select the serial port number 8. My programmer is connected with this laptop on the serial port 8. Now I'm going to compile the sketch and burn it on the ESP module. Here it is the sketch is compiling. Compilation is going on. It is taking a bit time. When the sketch start burning on the ESP module its own board blue LED will start blinking. Here you can see the blue LED on the ESP module start blinking and it's indicating that the ESP programmer is working properly and burning the sketch on the ESP12F module. When it is done the onboard LED of ESP12F module, will start blinking. It will keep on for a second and off for a second. Here it is about to complete. It is done, and now you can see the blinking with the frequency of 1 second. So the ESP module is programmed successfully and working awesome. Now I'm going to detach the ESP module from the programmer. Here it is the module on which firmware is burned. Now we can solder this module on PCB board or share this module with the friends without sharing the source code. Now if we are having a board like this, where ESP module is already soldered on the PCB board, if we want to change the firmware of the ASP module then we can directly plug it on the board. We can jack in this programmer on the CSP module in this way. Here it is connected and now we can be able to upload the new firmware on the CSP12F module very easily. This module is very useful. In different conditions and with the different type of modules, it works great. Hope you will like this module.
Thanks for watching this video.